Wednesday morning. I was up pretty late last night studying and reviewing. I have my first quiz for biochemistry today. I'm going to go to school in a little bit because I have a meeting. I did want to share what we're reading for Asian American literature, though, because I think that's pretty exciting. So we just finished reading Never Let Me Go last Thursday. I finished it before we started just so that I could get a good overview of what the book was about. And then I read it more in depth in a little bit, although it's not Asian American per se, but it was really good. And the next book is the epitome of Asian American dark academia literature, which is Babel by R.F. Kuang. I read this before as well. I read this over the summer. My second read through, I'm about halfway, a little bit less than halfway. It's a really good book. It's hefty for sure, but it's definitely worth a read while we're on the topic. The third book that we're going to be reading this quarter, which I've never heard of or read before, is Chemistry by Wei K. Wong. I'll keep you guys updated on my thoughts on this book, just based off of the blurb on the back. It seems really interesting. It seems very relatable. I suppose it's about somebody who is getting her PhD in chemistry, but then doesn't feel passionate about it. I'm really excited to read this book as well and let you guys know my thoughts when I get to it. Okay, I need to get back to studying, but I will chat with you guys later. I got back and I just had a crazy hectic moment and now I'm heading back to campus. I have a quiz in half an hour and I was going to study when I got back home today. I'm part of InterVarsity's vision team this year so we have our weekly meetings in, in the morning. I had a few tasks assigned to me, some logistical things that I had to work out. I got back and I didn't manage to pretty much get any studying done. p.m. on Thursday night. I got back a few hours ago from... Oh, the lights just turned off. Got back a few hours ago from an event that I was helping host for some international students and now I'm sitting down with some reading. I feel like I'm gonna be kicked out of this area pretty soon, which is fair because it's pretty pretty late at night. We had an international students event. We went to Shake Shack and got burgers together. 
Now I'm sitting down and reading Babel. We had our first discussion about Babel during Lit today, and it was a really good discussion. There were two other girls in my group that had also read the book before, and so we were kind of just trading smiles the entire time because we know what's going to happen in the book. I have an essay due next week that I haven't fully started on yet. I have a rough outline, but not really. And so there's definitely a lot of things to do, but it felt really good to just come up here or down here rather and sit by the fire and read for a little bit and still feel like I'm being productive not that being productive is you know the end all be all of life but still feels like I'm getting work done and checking things off my to-do list but just taking time for myself to unwind after a really hectic day and a really hectic week I feel very lucky to be able to do that I'm gonna turn in for the night soon I'm gonna go back to the apartment and yeah I'd probably just go to bed I haven't been sleeping a lot this past week and so um, I really need to catch up on some sleep I hope that you're also able to take some time for yourself Later, it's later at night and hi I thought I would end the vlog here thank you guys as always for joining it's been a hectic week but I'm glad that we were able to share it together and that it could be documented I hope you're doing well and I hope that you're taking care of yourself see you guys in the next video bye guys